Hi, this is Vu, and I wanted to show people who have Android phones one of the cool things you can do. Android phones let you have widgets, and there are many Bible verse of the day widgets that give you a random and new Bible verse every day. But some of us would like to have our own custom ones uh, that display just the verse we want and just the version we want, and it stays there until we erase it. That's useful if you want to memorize something. First thing we're gonna do is clear our home screen a little bit. So sometimes you'll have to erase either icons or widgets that are already on the screen. For instance, Android phones come with this little tip widget. So hold your finger down and you'll see a trash can appear either on the top or bottom of the screen. Go ahead and drag it to the trash can, let go, and away goes your widget. Go to the Android market and you're gonna to wanna to download two apps. One is called Memo Widget and that's by Sanjay Lee. The other is called Bible, and the author is going to be listed as Life Church TV. And you'll see here, it's actually by a website called Uversion. And go ahead and download this app also. Once you have both those apps loaded, we're going to go ahead and install our widget. So first things first, find a Bible verse you want to copy. We'll open our app drawer, and we're going to click on Bible. And once you have the Bible tapped open, Pick a verse that you want to copy. We'll just go ahead. It usually starts with a screen like this. Go ahead and tap on Bible and pick a, pick your book, pick your chapter, and pick your verse. And then go ahead and tap once on the verse you want to copy. Go ahead and tap on this little yellow thing on the bottom, this little yellow drop down box, and you'll see a menu come up. Tap on copy. That's going to copy it, and we're going to go ahead and paste it into a custom widget. So go ahead and tap the home screen key. Go ahead and hold down your finger on the home screen, and a little menu will pop up. Pick widgets. We're going to add a widget to the home screen. And then pick memo widget, and it'll give you a choice of what size you want. And you can experiment with the sizes. I like 4x1 or 4x2, because that's the full width of the screen. So we're going to go ahead and pick 4x1. And we're gonna go ahead and in the memo thing, we can type it in here manually, the verse, if you want. But I prefer to just hold down my finger, paste, and then I'll go ahead and delete the blank line. It's right there, the backspace key. And then I'm gonna hit the back key just once real quick. That'll get rid of the keyboard. And then we're gonna do, I prefer black text on a white background, okay? And then if you look down here at the preview, you'll see here, that's what it'll look like. I'm gonna shrink the font down just a little bit. Okay. There we go. That's kind of what I wanted to see is get the font shrunken down quite a bit. So you'll hit preview and that shows the preview. You can apply and then you'll see, boom, there it is on your screen, a persistent uh, Bible verse widget that you can go ahead, move it around if you want. Uh, move it to different screens if you like, or when you're done with it, go ahead and hold it down and erase it. If you wanted to change it, let's say for instance, oh, that font's too small. Tap on it once, tap on it again, and then go ahead and up your font size just a little bit. Hit apply, and go back to the home screen, and look, it's a little bit bigger. So that's how you go ahead and have a persistent Bible verse widget in Android 2, which is most phones that were released from 2011 and 2010. If you are one of the lucky few to have an Android 4 phone, the procedure is similar but just a little bit different. So here's an Android 4 phone. What we're going to do with those, and you know you have Android 4 because the menu, uh, typically because uh, you'll see the Google search looking like this, and you'll be able to swipe away your notifications. That's usually an Android 4 phone. Um, right now the only one is the Galaxy Nexus. There's sure to be more uh, for the spring and summer of 2012. We're going to go ahead and add a similar little Bible verse widget here. I've chosen a black background with white text because I have a darker wallpaper on this phone. So I'm going to walk you through that. First we're going to go ahead and open up the app drawer. We're going to go ahead and go on our Bible again. Hit the little Bible icon. Go ahead and pick a uh, Pick a Bible verse, Colossians 3.16, okay? And then I'm, I've tapped on it once, I'm gonna tap on the yellow. I'm gonna hit copy. 
Uh, if you're doing 40 days in the word with Saddleback, you'll notice that that's actually the week one burst. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and hit the home screen. You don't hold down on the home screen in uh, Android 4 anymore because there's no more widget anymore there. So what we have to do now is open up the app drawer, go to widgets up here at the top, and then go ahead and go to the find the memo widget you want. And that is gonna be alphabetical. Memo widget, I want the four by one size. You can do the four by two size. So the four by one, hold it down, and then put it where we want on the screen. And then you notice the nice thing about Android 4, and also Android 3, is that if there's no room on that screen, you can just kind of move left and right until you find a screen that has room on it. So here's a screen that has some room on it. So we're gonna go over to our home middle screen here, and we'll drop it down here. And then it's gonna ask us to type in the text again. Once again, hold it down, hit paste, okay? I'm gonna get rid of that one extra line. And then we're gonna go ahead and pick our text color. I would like, for this phone, I would like white text on a black background. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and backspace once, that gets rid of the keyboard. We're gonna go ahead and hit preview, and that's gonna show it here. You'll notice it's way too long. Uh, so what we need to do is shrink down. And once we shrink down, it's gonna go ahead and get to a more manageable size. Okay, we'll hit apply. And there we go. You'll notice that some of my text is a little bit hanging over, so we're gonna have to make the font smaller uh, if we wanna fit that all. So I'm gonna go ahead and tap it again. And you'll notice here, now it's showing, because I have multiple widgets, it's showing multiple things. So we'll pick the widget that we did, or the verse that we did, and we're gonna go ahead and shrink that one up a little bit. Hit apply, hit the home screen, and it's made a little smaller. We've got a little more tailoring to do if we wanna go ahead and fit that all in one screen but you guys kind of get the point there as to how to do your uh, Bible verse widgets, both in Android 2 and Android 4. Hope that helps. Thanks for watching and uh, have a good one.